the JES First Warning Weather Center. Here's meteorologist April Loveland. Well, we have been dealing with flash flooding all day today. Looks like that's going to continue to be an issue as we head through the overnight and into the day tomorrow. You can see the lime green boxes, all the areas where we're currently dealing with some flash flood warnings, the darker shade of green there. That's a flash flood watch. That's in effect until tomorrow morning, which means we do have that threat to see some flash flooding. So we'll continue to see that rainfall overnight into tomorrow morning, especially in midday. We'll start to see those chances going down, though, by tomorrow afternoon. So I think the morning and and midday hours are going to be the wettest part of the day and we'll kind of see that rain let off let, let up by the afternoon highs only around 84 again so not quite as warm as we have been that flood threat for Sunday a slight chance for some showers on Monday and Tuesday but I think those are going to be our two driest days of the week because as we head into Wednesday Thursday Friday and Saturday we are looking at an unsettled weather stretch another stationary front will set up shop over our area and that's going to keep us very unsettled we'll see some scattered storms Wednesday Thursday Thursday, Friday, and even into Saturday. Those highs, though, warming back to the upper 80s to near 90. That is your first warning storm team forecast.